Yeah? Jody. Hey, it's, it's Ryan. Ryan! I was just wondering if you got my email. What, what, wait, what, what email? The one I sent three days ago. You know, I've, I've actually been having problems with my computer. What, what was the email about? Dinner, tonight, fancy restaurant. <laughs> anyway, it, it's too late now, so maybe another time? Shit. Shit, I'm so sorry. I... You, no, why, why don't you just come over here for dinner tonight? I mean, you wanted to see my apartment anyway, so... Uh, sure, but I... How about around eight? Just... Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll bring a kick-ass bottle of wine. See you later. Now I get why you blasted my computer. You didn't want me to see Ryan. It's not your call, Aiden. I can do what I want. Fuck this. Fuck this! We're not gonna start this again! I'm not yours, Aiden! I can have a relationship with whoever I want. This is my life. Do you fucking hear me? This is my life. You know what? I happen to think Ryan is great. I mean, he's charming, he's intelligent, he's funny. And I think I'm falling for him. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm aware of what happened at the bar. Fuck you for reminding me. Ryan is not like that. Okay. Okay. It's seven o'clock. I have an hour to make dinner, tidy up, and make myself look good. All right, books. On the bookshelf. Okay, great. Right. The trash can in the kitchen. You know, you're wasting your time, Aiden. You're not gonna stop me from seeing Ryan. Oh my God. Oh my God, the dinner. Okay, there, there's gotta be something in the kitchen. I gotta find something I can make in one hour with what's ever left in the fridge. Asian beef, oh. I mean, that looks good. It's not too complicated. Curried chicken with oven-baked vegetables. 
It'll take some time in the oven, but it seems doable. Pizza delivery. I mean, it's not exactly gourmet, but it, it, no preparation, no mess. I mean, it could be an option. Time to decide, girl. Pizza. I mean, it's it's the easy way out, but he's not gonna mind. Now I'll call him. Well, maybe he'll expect like a real dinner. Yeah. Asian beef. I mean, it looks suitably exotic. As long as I don't manage to fuck it up. Thanks, Aiden. So far, so good. Use a walk. Oh, crap. Crap, he's early. I haven't finished cooking. I better hurry or we'll have nothing to eat. Ginger. It's supposed to be an aphrodisiac. I mean, it's not in the recipe, but... 
can't hurt. I mean, I need all the help I can get. All right, add the sake for flavor. I think I'm beginning to like cooking. Ryan, you are gonna love this. Huh. Yeah, that's very funny, Aiden. Wow, it's very romantic. <laughs> Dirty clothes in the basket in the bathroom. All right, there. Aiden, don't be a pain in the ass.
should I wear? Oh, hello, Ryan. Oh, do you like it? Classic, elegant, a je ne sais quoi. I don't want to give them the wrong idea. Oh. Oh, hey, Ryan. Yeah, whatever. I just like threw these old things on because, yeah, I'm cool. I'm cool. Is it not enough effort? Oh, hi, Ryan. I've been waiting for you. I don't know. Classy. It's the new me, and it shows that I can adapt to any situation. You might as well just give up, Aiden. Okay? This date is going on. Period. Yeah, oh well. I didn't behave yourself. This is important to me, and I'm counting on you. I... <laughs> uh, Chateau Margot, 2001. The guy in the store said it was a pretty good year. That sounds good to me. So. Why don't you sit? Um, I'll get the, um, the thing that opens the wine. <laughs> cool apartment. Huh? Yeah, thanks. I didn't. For fuck's sakes. You want me to open it? No, no, I'll do it. Okay. <laughs> to your new apartment. To my new apartment. Oh, so when did you move in? Um, a couple weeks ago. Yeah, the agency found it for me and all furnished and everything. It's just, it's actually the first place I've ever had. Just, it's all, it's weird. And how about you? Where, where do you live? Oh, I uh, have a place to stop for the town. Did you, did you grow up here? Or? No, no, I, I was born in Oregon. Now my parents and brothers still live there. But I, I moved out when I was 16. 16? Oh. Did you get, get kicked out or 
or something? Uh, well, things were pretty chaotic at home. My, my stepfather, like... Aiden's messing with us. Ignore him. Ignore him. Um, how did you end up joining the CIA? I, uh, I went through college, not really knowing what I wanted to do. I'm gonna go check on the dinner because this cooking thing, it's a whole new adventure for me. <laughs> you need help? No, but why don't you go sit and more wine would be nice. <laughs> okay. Uh, Asian beef, right? Yeah. No, I was sent to China for a year. I love Asian food. Oh, well, do not get your hopes up, because this is probably the second time that I've cooked, and I would rather not talk about the first time. Mm. This is good. Oh. Good. I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad you like it. So we've been working together now for what, like two years? I mean, almost nothing about you. You sure everything's okay? Yes, everything's fine. Aiden is just... <laughs> he's just feeling a little nervous. It's okay, really. You know, did, did Nathan ever manage to explain to you why you have this link with Aiden? No. I mean, not really. I mean, they learn... Jody, I, I think there's something wrong with Aiden. Give me a second. I'm fed up with you and your goddamn jealousy. So why don't you just go back to the place you came from and let me get on with my life? Get out of here. Do you fucking hear me? Get the fuck out! <coughs> it's um, probably just the, the, the dishes. I, mu I must have piled them too high. Uh, Aiden's not happy with me being I don't give a damn how Aiden feels. Uh, what about you? Do you have, do you have any family here? No, no, my uh, my parents are still in Oregon. Go to see them as little as possible. <laughs> Fuck, Aiden! I need you to just stop. Listen, I I better go. No, no, Ryan, wait. No, Jody, look, I, <laughs> Aiden's very possessive. I, I think you got to work it out with him. Jody, look. 
We need to rush it. Hey, let's just take some time to get to know each other. Maybe I even wind up being okay with that. You happy now? You get what you wanted. He's gone, and now you have me to yourself. I really hope you're delirious and happy. Why don't you just float around in your invisible world and watch me cry? I hate you! Do you hear me?